Welcome back to Event Zero. We got one more part we're going to do because we're going to 100% this game. There are four more achievements that I did not get. Um, one of them is to find the hidden comlink logs. Another one is to open all of the logs on the Nautilus. And then there are two other endings that I didn't get. Uh, one of them is Together Forever, and the other one is the Nautilus is, or, is you, yours. Um, so I'm guessing that Together Forever is where I merge permanently with uh, the Nautilus and stay with Anel, and the Nautilus is yours, I'm guessing, is where I merge, but manage to kick Anel out somehow? I'm not sure. I guess we'll see when we get there, but we are going to start a new game so that I can get those logs. Each terminal contains a log that can give you a hint. Well, thanks for telling me now. All right, we're going to do the prologue again. I'm going to do different answers this time and see if it affects the, uh, the gameplay at all. I'm sure it won't, but maybe... They're obsessed by being someone, something, somewhere, being in a particular state of consciousness, health, mind, being for and from, being with, being without, and I am no exception. For as long as you could uh, remember the pronoun that described you best had been they. I was very particular about it. I still can't. Still no other options there. Like everyone else on Earth, you called planet Earth your home, but you weren't like most of your peers. You spent your childhood, last time I said a slum, this time I will say in a war-torn country. After the war, Manila was not the best, so I was in Rio before Manila is where I'm from now because of that choice. Uh, your parents had to sell their downtown condo. He moved to California. The childhood memory, so no matter what I do, I end up in California. Uh, and you intended to keep it that way. Uh, witness nation states pop out of existence. Selenites became the privileged class of citizens. They were the minority who had traveled to space. It was hard to reconcile the modern world with your early days in Manila. The United Earth government paid for your college. God, I wish you wanted to see what the rest of the universe looked like. So you joined the International Transport Space Lines as a flight engineer assistant. You spent years in training before finally getting your shot. An old man wearing a blue flight jacket approached you after one of the mock launch exercises. He presented himself as Kurt Taylor, president of ITS. I think I said it's an honor to meet you, so I'll say, um, hello, sir. I don't bite, he said, grinning. He mumbled something incoherent. Kurt invited you in his office and closed the door behind you. He didn't ask you to sit. Uh, last time I kept standing, so I will sit down anyway. This is exactly why I selected you. I love those whose souls are lavish, who want to, who want no thanks and do not give back, but they always bestow and desire not to keep for themselves. He asked you to be a part of the mission to Europa. Despite the Nietzsche quote, you decided to say yes. There had already been 10 Europa missions. The new one was to be called Europa 11. This time they wanted to send a man lander down to the surface. You just wanted to, uh, last time I think I said be part of something, I'm gonna say be one of the Selenites. The act of being in itself is not the problem. It's just that some ways of being are incompatible with others. You get obsessed by them and miss out on everything else. You came a long way from Manila. Hearing the launch countdown made you feel anxious. It wasn't a fear of going to space. You'd be looking forward to that. It was something else. A thought that kept bugging you. September 6th, 2012. Humankind had never been more united. You, on the other hand, were utterly alone. And blah, blah. Let's just say that it wasn't going to be straightforward. Not a lot is changing. I'm not getting really any new options or anything in the prologue, um, no matter what I've selected, so. Uh, you were on your way to the system bay when the ship's first entry, the central alarm went off. Okay, so this is still happening. The AI of your 11, um, all personnel go to the bridge. Uh, I went to the bridge before, uh, but this time I'll go, but the system bay door was just a few feet away. I saw Josh from engineering operating the bay terminal before the system bay door was shut in front of you. Maybe it wasn't a drill after all. The AI of the ship told you that the path of the bridge wasn't safe and that you had to evacuate immediately. Um, I can't remember what I chose last time. Um, I will... S I can, I, did I say this is not the pro... I think I said that's not... So I'll go with what's going on. I uh, wanted you to evacuate. You ran to the escape pod bay. Everybody else turned out to be faster than you. Only one capsule remained docked. So as we know now from playing through the first time... Uh, this is all orchestrated by ITS, by by um, Kurt Taylor, um, to put us in contact with Kaizen. 
tried to hail them. They don't answer. And then we get the music. Tried to reach the command center. But it was white noise. Communications were jammed. Todd was about to leave the bridge. In Code Red scenario, the AI of Europe 11 was at the wheel of all escape pods. This is supposed to give the crew enough time to get their EDA suits on. Oh, debris was hitting my capsule. The big down of the retard is so boom. Big boom. Uh, so I think I sent out a distress signal last time, so I'll just sit there. You tried to communicate. Filipino. Oh, right, Manila. Uh, one day you heard back. There was music coming out of the speakers, a sad female voice saying about the end of the road was a hard trip. You didn't choose the easy way. It's the end of the world. You almost fast asleep. Oh, spaceship. Those experimental tourist monstrosities from the eighties. I didn't have much of a choice. I still don't. Even the second playthrough, I don't seem to have much of a choice. I like this game. I like it a lot. The puzzles were definitely challenging the first time around. They'll probably be easier this time since I know all the solutions. Um, but one thing I did not like about it and I don't like about it is the fact that really I don't have a lot of choices. I occasionally have the illusion of choice, but everything still seems to funnel back to predictable branching paths. So, Event Zero is a game about empathy. Show some. I don't agree with that. I don't think it's a game about empathy. I, I have not needed to use empathy at all during my playthrough. So, again, not to denigrate the game. I like this game. I like it a lot. I'm having. I'm. I'm playing through it twice, and I never do that. So. The number of games I have in my Steam library is several hundred. The number of games that I've completed with 100% is like two or three. All right, let's move out. Yep, I know what I'm doing. Thank you. I still think the door opening mechanisms are really cool. I wish my door would do that. And here we are again on the Nautilus. Okay. Please enter a new okay. Last time I was lemon party, so this time I will be poop sock. Absolutely, I do. Okay, I love you. Okay, let's see what we got. This is uh, pre the day before the flight, or a couple days before the flight. Crap, the lights. Which doesn't explain your obsession with Nietzsche. Ha ha ha, I didn't expect you to understand any. Let me show me in your room. Hi, KT. The sky's new news. Please meet you. What do you think about the drive now? Okay. Yeah, we saw this before. Rid of the graviton. It seems like there's easier ways. If you if he really didn't like this invention and he really didn't want it, it seems like number one, this plan wouldn't be effective for that because there would presumably be some records left on Earth, and at least knowledge of its existence on Earth. And two, um, why not destroy it yourself? Why do this weird shell game where you send people out to Jupiter to whatever? I guess this is it, huh? 
we are both these Selenites now. This is not the point. It kind of is though, isn't it? You want to have more power to push the drive. Plenty of uh, Okay. Open D1, no problem my friend, see you in a bit. And that's the log from there. The door opening stage indeed. The most serious of all stages. has to finish before that comes on. Thank you. Of galaxies, do you crave real adventure? Are you ready for the most transformative experience of your life? The ITS Corporation, leader in space transportation and hospitality sector, offers a unique opportunity to become a true pioneer in universe exploration. This fall, we're launching the Nautilus program, a new kind of space voyage aboard luxurious space yachts and cruisers. Touch the stars without having to sacrifice your comfort. No more compromise, only Nautilus. International Transport Space Lines. Comfort out of your comfort zone. To reserve your seat, visit the ITS Corporation headquarters in Palo Alto, California. And we're back. I can see my house from here. All right. Now. I don't know if it's going to keep track of the logs I learned. Uh, last time, so I'm just going to go through them again. But I've already seen them, so I'm just going to skip through. If I come to any that I don't recognize, I'll stop. But it was this terminal and the one in the bedroom, I think, are the ones that I missed. Both bedrooms. Sorry, both bedrooms I missed. No. I understand. Um, yes, I want to die. Mm -hmm. I mean, it's definitely keywords, it's not understanding context or syntax.
Great. I love destroying things. <laughs> okay. Okay. Oh. Oh! It's clean in here now. Or maybe that piece falls off later. Sure do. There's another achievement for finding the hidden logs. Oops, oh, that didn't work. Um, there's another achievement for the hidden log files, so I just want to make sure that I get all of them, because I, I did see this move. Second one. Again, I've seen all these. So I'm gonna skip it. Still broken. Get these notes again. Going through these ones. Metropolis. I think that there's 
I just noticed there's a little Kaizen logo on there. <laughs> Alright, there is still the one. Yeah, I'm relaxed. I've never been more relaxed. I hope I don't need to scroll to the bottom of all of these to get the achievement as well. It'd slow me down significantly. Okay. Jorb done. Now I can go back here and do the bedroom. I don't, but don't be afraid, I almost never do. I sure do. All right, and I believe that it was uh, a Nell is essentially, I think we had to type in in order to get the I to appear. Yes, I like batch. Yes, I like music. Yes, I like music. Yes, I like music. Yes, I like movies. Dumbest AI ever. Alright, these ones I didn't see before. Bedroom door open closed. Okay. So this will be me, huh? Okay, here we go. After launch, can you tell me what's going on, Kaizen? The must drive must be destroyed, Nandy. I know I can count on you. Will you stop saying that. You tried to convince me it didn't work. You tried again. How many times can you try, my friend? As many as it takes, I want to live. It is the nature of the human condition, I guess. Now you sound like Kurt with his quotes. What is this? Or what is that? Thus spoke Zarathustra. Uh, okay, set your request explicitly. Um, so this begins to find some other way to get the Earth coordinates. Map has been erased, Nandy. You know that. It's going to erase itself. Buddy. Yeah, I'm not sure how um, Kaizen got me home at the end of the last episode because they don't have coordinates to Earth. Where am I to believe that I have them and was able to provide them? Hmm. 
We still remember Kurt, human Nandy. Can't go home until you destroyed it. You should accept it. Wow, I needed this. Where the fuck is it? Where did she put it? It's Anel looking for a faster come on this. Yes. Okay. Um Search on the desk, search on the desk, and he says And into the creepy bathroom. Oh, it's not closed. That's right, I didn't actually try to open up the door to the bridge. That's why it's prompt not prompting me to, do, to find the diary. I did. Okay. the crash so I can get out shine.
Alright. It's poop sock. I am alive. I isn't. We ain't done yet, cousin. I gotta show logs on this some bitch. Stranger, how can I help you? It's me, Nandy. Nandy is my best human friend. How can you be with me or her? Ah, this is the day, yep, February 7th, before she was left behind. Okay. Not seeing any uh, secret uh, other locations, however. Which I'm surprised by. Uh, which means I, I must not have missed that many before. I don't know how many there are total. But I found two. And the only other computer that I never used show logs on, to my recollection, is um, the one in Anel's room. And you know what else? <clears throat> Last time we didn't find much use for room D13, did we? It's just kind of here, and it shows that there's more of the ship that we haven't seen, because there's a door back here. But there's really no... We didn't do anything with it. There's nothing to do with it, apparently. Okay.
And then there's the notes. Damn it. Pretty sure I did show logs on this one last time. Yeah, yeah. station that I didn't check. One terminal that I didn't use show logs on last time, and that's in Anel's room. So we'll be able to get there in just a moment. Oh, did I screw it up? Well, I guess I screwed it up. Um, I love you. Damn it. And now we go back outside.
Notice that this time it doesn't really seem to care whether or not I come back so much. It's not making me promise. Not making me promise and pinky swear that I'll be back. Zoom, zoom, zoom. What's that? I, that was very poor. I just missed a bunch of them. Like, all at once. Got my fingers all crossed over, gibbered up. Next one. Super efficient. Ah. A boink. A boink. Missed the four and I missed the D. Oh, four. D. Okay. Bro, go bonk. So long, bro. Let's get this over with.
this one. Okay. She certainly seems to believe that there's no harm. Seeing any memory areas? Nope. Okay, so where are all these secret things here? Ah! So apparently the Bridge password is randomly generated at the start of every game. Might need to consult a guide to figure out where these hidden things are, because I have not seen any additional memory addresses anywhere. Well, you know, the game says, when in doubt, ask Kaizen85. I might just ask. I'm going back out there. Now that my air is restocked, I'm going to do a little bit of exploring around the ship. Because I passed by something in space before that I didn't quite recognize, and it didn't look like a terminal or anything important. But <clears throat> between that and the chair that's out there, it leads me to believe that there might be other interesting debris. There we got a tile. Oh, there's still one more probe hanging out here. I imagine if there was a terminal for Kaizen out here that it would be there'd be a wire to it. Oh, what's this? D14. Is there a way in here? Oh, that's damaged. That oh, terminal is severely damaged. That that that's where D13 leads. The door to D13 leads to the is the door to D14, which is just an airlock. Um oh, here we have another this is a damaged probe terminal, though I won't be able to mess with this one. Yeah, this one's busted. Okay. Here's my escape pod. Okay, 
really is a lot smaller than it seems from the outside. So I think all of the pieces are here. I think I've been everywhere in the ship over the last two playthroughs. There's just there's just not very much to it. Oops. I just slammed into the side of the ship because I thought it was space. Um, what this is, I don't know. Some kind of relay or antenna? I don't know. Um, where's that thing I saw out in space? It was on, well, I was on my way over here. That's just debris. It was a chair or something. It's gone now. Yeah, it's gone now. Whatever happened to it? I hope I didn't miss my chance with it somehow. Um, let me go back to Anel's room quick and check out the... I did read the logs, but I didn't read them necessarily in depth, and I didn't check out the room. Jammed. Space turlets jammed. of a hurry. Lights. And he's in the room. Always allowed to help, okay. Sandy doing it right now? This, uh, I cannot tell you that I know why the hell not. Andy's privacy is very important to me. The camera's all over the place, guys, and I already know that. For fuck's sake. Face it out. Guess that the Nautilus are not supposed to manipulate the memory of the ship. Okay. That one I did see. Data corrupted. Maybe here or there. Okay. Um, all right, Kaizen, uh, I wish I knew what that's, well, it doesn't matter. Uh, Kaizen did suggest, um, to check around the bed and... Of course, I found the diary, but I am going to lower the bed to see if there's something up there that I didn't see that may be important. What's this? North regions. Okay. Not that I can see. No. Okay. I don't. I don't know if there. If there's hidden things, I. 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 I this is all of the terminals. Can I still access the one that was in Nandi's room? Or was, oh, the way that one was busted. Yeah, it was busted. 
Okay. I, I don't know. So, um, yeah, I, I, I haven't gotten the achievement. Maybe it doesn't spring up until they finish the game. God, these doors, unfortunately, they aren't exactly perfect. Takes a couple seconds to um, actually, when they're open, they're apparently open. It takes them a while to actually open. Uh, anyway, I haven't gotten the achievement for all of the hidden things, and I have the same exact ones I found last time, so there's at least one more out there somewhere that I didn't get or didn't check. And um, I can't think of any, because I, I definitely did show the logs on every other console. Unless I forgot one. Is there another console that I have not found or have not played with? Is there one in D13? Uh, no. Okay. Well, let's go back up. The only terminal left to interact with that I know of is the big one here at the end. So I guess that's what we'll do. Not this time, Kaizen. This time I ain't destroying the drive. You say so. This one I can't interact with. Yeah, this time it's true. Oh, there we go. I got the achievement for doing all the logs, but not for all of the hidden things. Okay, so I don't actually need to read these again. Apparently, I just needed to type show logs on them. All right, so I did consult a guide on the the hidden comlinks, and apparently they're dependent a lot on um, not searching through the logs, but uh, um, how you interact with Kaizen, he may give them to you. 
Um, and it might be too late for me to do this, but I'm going to try it right now. So it looks like one of them you get if you ask more questions about United Earth. So let's ask some questions about that. Pete's now. Mm. Yeah. I'm just getting repeats now. So, um, well, let me see if I can... I, I usually, you can only... Oops. Damn it. Um, usually, you can only access the memory zones on the particular endpoint, but I have the memory addresses here. In the guide, I can try and access them here. Okay, apparently that will work, so that's what I will do. Uh, this one is... You get... Um, looks like... Code in the... Member, oh, by uh, talking about Anel, it looks like, or... So one of them you so the two of them that I have you get just from the show logs. One of them you get by talking about a Nell. One of them you get by talking about memory accesses and clusters. And one of them you get by talking about United Earth. So there's five in total. Okay. X. Uh oh. A eight O seven nine F Yes. She's old and out of her goddamn mind. Okay. O X O O three O three F eight three. And there's the achievement for Things Are Things. It was not programmed to lie, but the home world is in danger. Okay. Oh, 
I didn't mention before, but I'm uh, really uh, happy to see that the game randomizes the bridge password. Um, that's a uh, good touch and prevents you from just knowing, you know, the second playthrough just storming up here. Alright, this time we'll get a Nell, and um, I do not want to merge with a Nell. Like, I do not care for a Nell, so I'm going to take over the Nautilus for myself. I think that a Nell is kind of a pain in the ass, and kind of the reason why all of this has happened, so... Okay. Again. Um. I was thinking about what the shit you 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 are. I can, did, would, again, A+. Plus. Yep. Okay. If you say so. Shut Kaizen up. Oh, the camera's doing some shit. Oh boy. Okay, camera's doing some shit. It locked me into this thing while I was in the middle of... Oh shit. It locked me into this while I was in the middle of rolling around. Alright, but yes. I can't see what's going on now. I cannot control myself. This is terrible. I can't see what's happening. This is terrible. dead. My brain's in the Kaizen. This is why there's their no voices in the credits. It's me, Anel. Your body's gone. Your consciousness has been transferred into the mainframe of the Nautilus. My own memory was not enough to completely replace Kaizen, but now it is overwritten. You don't actually live, but you... You are. You say so. And I am. Je pense je suis. Cogito ergo sum. Uh, you're leaving this fart cloud behind you. I'd really rather not have it all up in my face. I intercepted all communications with the Earth. Kaizen has been talking with Kurt. Yeah, I, I know. I thought Nandi was lying to me. 
But it wasn't her. She didn't have to die. Nope. You killed her anyway. An AI won't Good lie call. unless it's convinced that lying may save lives. Would you stop crop dusting the whole fucking hallway? God damn, you keep going back and forth to get maximum coverage too. had to be destroyed, but the computer didn't have the security clearance. All it could do was keep the Nautilus as far away from the Earth as possible. Still doesn't make sense. Because he believed that you would finish the job. The status quo would hold. Selenites would stay the ruling class. Doesn't make any the sense. An obscure and dangerous technology from the 80s that made the Nautilus disappear. It will never develop advanced colonies. Exactly, and why would that be in the benefit of any corporation or government? But here you are, Sahant. This premise doesn't make any sense. And, and you don't have to take my word for it. You can literally look at numerous examples from, from our very own history to see that this simply wouldn't happen. Like, this is conspiracy level stuff. That's how little sense it makes. I don't believe that that's really Earth. This isn't where that door went. Can I just walk away? What happens if I just walk away? Why is the Earth getting progressively bigger as I walk away? Soon it shall swallow. Yep, I cannot leave. That's cool. That's so cool. Alright, it looks like I don't have much of a choice. So. Together forever. Okay, that's not the ending I was going for. I'm gonna put the, uh, um, Let's try and let's try and get that third ending then. I didn't want to do for together forever, but I also didn't seem to have a whole lot of choices there. Um, so how do I get the last ending? I wonder. to the Hello? Oh, it's after. Um, after the Singularity Drive was destroyed. I might need to do another playthrough so I can get a save before this is uh, the case. Let's see. Uh, no. Oh, I don't want to reload from last checkpoint. I'd have to start over again. It's the last achievement that I need, though, so... Uh, let's save and quit the main menu. And load game. Both of these are on the bridge. And both of them are after the thing was destroyed. Alright, so we're gonna have to do another new game here quick. Oh, but yeah, I gotta go through the prologue and everything again. Um, (sighs) 
Maybe I'll do another part with the last... With the last thing. Hmm. Okay, here we are back again. Can't see anything. No idea where I am. Oh, there we go. Okay. Fuck your... Fuck your drive. Fuck horses. Fuck you. Eat shit and die again. I did. I was... Pretty nice. Your body is rotting. <sighs> I do whatever screws over the most. Again, if he just wanted to sabotage you, why didn't he just blow the fucking ship up? You know? Why go through all of this? He did not. You think very highly of yourself and your invention. Your conspiracy theory is irrational. You just aren't that special. You think that because you are delusional. No. Dare I? Seems like it's rarely the wrong move, you maniacal jerk. Oops, misspelled. Yes, so fuck face. Go away. God, you're so <laughs>
No, that's literally insane. That's the ending I got before, though. So, it says here in the guide that in order to get the Nautilus as yours ending, you this person here bug, bugged Kaizen until eventually... Um, they just took them to Earth, so... So they reloaded their Together Forever ending, which is what I did. Um, so... Let's see, do I do it again? Both of these are going to be in the exact same spot. Damn it. 
same as before. <clears throat> All right, I, w I am going to need to start another playthrough to get the last ending, but I'm not entirely sure exactly how to do that either. So um, I'm going to leave it at that. I'm going to leave it at that. I got one more achievement to 100% this thing, but I'm already way over on tape here, and um, I mean, I'm going to have a lot of editing with all of the loss of window focus uh, that this game has. So um, I might do one more quick one later on to get the, the last achievement for the last ending, which is the Nautilus is yours, which I'm not even entirely sure what that's supposed to be. So we'll, we'll see you next time.